Hey guys, so I am at uni. This is my last full day at university and I'm going to the barbecue for the ACS at my university. It's actually quite weird, like, I'm going back home. Like, I'm happy to go back home. I feel like a lot of my flatmates were really excited to go back home. We don't want to, like, leave each other and not be with each other, like, I've had so much fun at uni. Like, my flatmates are so amazing. Don't get me wrong, they drive me crazy, especially the guys. Like, especially in the hallway, because you can hear absolutely everything. Yeah, I'm gonna miss them. So, this is my outfit for the barbecue. This is mustard jumpsuit from Bershka. And then I'm wearing bands. So as you guys know, I went back home on Sunday for our international service at church. Um, and it was so good, like, my mum is Dominican, so we wore the Dominican attire and colours, and it was honestly so fun. The message was on different cultures and how we can celebrate cultures, but we shouldn't allow it to stop us from doing God's will and doing good. And the message was about the Good Samaritan in Luke 10 verse 25, I believe. Um, I have my notebook and Bible out here. <laughs> I was just looking at it um, about how the Good Samaritan was like hafted on the road. The priest walked by, the Levite walked by, and the person that stopped to look after him and ultimately save him was a Samaritan. And the Samaritans and the Jews didn't actually get on. And more than that, Samaritans and Jews hated each other, cultural differences, loads of that, but the Samaritan put that aside. Um, and so what I've learned is that I should not allow my cultural differences or my societal or any of that to allow myself from doing God's will and I'm in awe that someone who would have been ridiculed for helping this guy um, whose family would have been disgusted um, whose, whose community would have been horrified that he touched this man helped this man um, I'm in awe that he still did that but yeah I'm so excited to do some sit down videos with you guys sorry I'm moving around a lot let me find a spot to put you. Yes. There you go. I'm excited to do sit down videos. I know I've been saying for a while that I'm going to do them, but I am doing them, guys. I am filming them. I am planning them. I am getting ideas. Um, so my next sit down video is going to be a how I found my first year at university, which is going to be fun. I've got some ideas for that. Um, talking about how it's been being a Christian, how it's been just first year, how it's been settling in, my flatmates and stuff. I'm really blessed for my flatmates, I'm really grateful for them. So I'm gonna be talking about that. Then I'm gonna be doing a QA, and a but guys, I need to do a QA. and a you need questions. And I have been getting questions from some people, but I do really want all of you guys to ask me questions so I can have a really good Q&A that you guys will actually want to watch and will actually take from. You can ask questions about me, questions about my lifestyle, questions about just like, teenager young adult stuff anything ask me anything just yeah i want to like sit down and talk to you guys because i like this i love vlogging and i love capturing moments but i feel like when i look back at them sometimes i'm like ah like you guys are experiencing it but like you don't really get to see much of me and obviously you know this is my channel so yeah oh and by the way my makeup i did it on the train on the way here i did it in like 15 like maybe 20 minutes if that so my eyebrows are Anastasia Beverly Hills in dark brown my eyeshadow is very basic today it's the Morphe 350 palette mascara is L'Oreal Lash Paradise concealer is NARS stretch matte concealer no stretch is glossier NARS soft matte concealer in hazelnut the foundation is the Tarte clay stick you guys would have known how much I love it for my March favorites I'm gonna try and do another monthly favorite um, as well uh, my lip liner is from NYX and my lip colour, my lip colour is um, NYX as well. What is the colour called? Let me check. I hope I'm not too overdressed for this barbecue. I know everyone's going to be glowing up, so. It is Berlin. Oh, I went to Berlin. That's so cute. Um, I got it before I went to Berlin. Uh, the denim jacket is Dorothy Perkins, absolutely love it. It is oversized, it's meant to be oversized because I bought size up. I love the rips. Um, and I'm looking glossy here because I creamed. So yeah, it's going to be really sad leaving my um, university room, taking down my photos, 
you know, taking down all my stuff. It's going to be really sad, but I'm glad that I've kind of, like, I finished on the 21st and I've been going, like, back and forth home to uni. And so now I feel like it's okay to move out, whereas if I moved out straight away, I would have probably been, felt quite upset. But, yeah, I am glad to go home and have a great summer. And I honestly wish my flatmates the best. I hope we can keep in contact. We probably will. Um, and, yeah, I've had the best time at university. It's been ups and downs, especially with assignments and exams and stress. And But I've, I've had a good time. I've learnt a lot and I've met some good people. So I'm just going to take down my photos from my wall now. It's about time because I'm getting picked up tomorrow to go home officially from uni. So here's a time lapse. That didn't work. So here's a time lapse. Hey guys, so I've just taken it all down and look at all the marks the white tack made. Even though I thought white tack was not meant to stain, apparently it does. And here are my um, pictures that I've taken down. I've put them all into piles. So these are my prom photos and my photo of Nadine. These are all the photos I've taken at university that are non-cheer. These are my cheer photos. These are my friendship group from school. This is the student retreat, which is in a vlog if you haven't seen it. I'll link it down below, the student retreat faith talk vlog. This is just a ticket to take me out of uni. These are my Bible scriptures. This is my year 11 prom photo with a massive hole in because I stuck a pin in it. These are my family photos. This is in Portugal, me and my bro. Disney, etc, etc. This is my last holiday last summer, Lanzarote. This is a real picture with a real dolphin. I know it looks kind of staged, but yeah. And this is where I get my photos from, free prints. So yeah, this is it. It's so weird because um, behind me I'd usually have photos, but I don't. So I'm just gonna take all the blue tack off of this now and put it in the bin. Yeah, I hope you guys have a great rest of the day and keep in contact with me my twitter will be down below um comment down below how you guys at university have felt about leaving and if you are not university comment down below what you think you would be looking forward to for university or for your apprenticeship or whatever you're doing after school so yeah i love you guys all and i'll see you soon